Welcome back to STL TV Live. I'm Sarah Bernard and I'm joined by Kristen Fleischman Brewer, the manager of programs for the Pulitzer Foundation for the Arts. Welcome, Kristen. Thank you, Sarah. So tell us what's going on down at the Pulitzer Foundation for the Arts. What are you all up to these days? So the Pulitzer Foundation for the Arts is an arts institution in Grand Center mm -hmm. and we have six month exhibitions and programs, public programs and community projects. We're both a laboratory and a sanctuary for the arts and we work with collaborators locally and nationally to do projects. Okay, so and you've got an upcoming project that sounds pretty interesting, the Marfa Dialogues. Yes, so Marfa Dialogues St. Louis is a, our big project for the summer. It's happening July 30th through August 3rd and it's a collaboration between the Pulitzer Foundation for the Arts, Ballroom Marfa, which is a nonprofit contemporary art space in Marfa, Texas, and the Public Concern Foundation, who's a nonprofit that is focused on the public discourse and widening the public discourse of political and social topics. So what the Marfa Dialogues does is it brings together artists, designers, creative people with scientists to talk about climate change. And that's what's actually happening at the end of July then, that discussion? So yes, during the five-day program, we'll have a variety of projects happening. So not only will both the Pulitzer, Ballroom Marfa, and the Public Concern Foundation be creating projects that are happening at the Pulitzer, but we are also uh, commissioning grants by local St. Louisans to do projects that bring together climate change science, the arts, looking at imaginative solutions for these, mm -hmm. um, these problems in the Midwest and how we can look at them and see how our daily actions uh, impact the global climate and then what we can do about them. So what is the, is there an expected outcome from this event happening at the end of the summer? Um, do you think it'll, there'll be action steps or things that come out of the dialogue specifically or is it just more the beginning of the conversation? Well, we hope so. We, we want there to be outcomes. We don't want it just to be about talking. We want it to be mm -hmm. about action. So the projects that we hope to commission through the grants are really solution oriented. So we hope that these projects bring together um, artists, designers, scientists to think of different ways that we can look at interacting with the world, um, our city. And um, yes, it's a, first, it's a first step, but we definitely want it to expand um, what people think that they can do to engage with this and learn more, share ideas, mm -hmm. and hopefully lead to projects. Yeah, and everybody's talking about climate change right now, <laughs> coming out of the winter we all had across yes. this country. Yes, So It's a big topic. Yeah, so what's the grant um, application process then? How's, what's involved with that? So what we're asking people to do, it's filling out a simple two-page application, talking about their project, uh, the grant application is on our website, mm -hmm. pulitzerarts.org, and we're simply asking people to submit project proposals for programs, exhibitions, film screenings. It can be a variety of different types of projects, and they can happen all over the St. Louis metropolitan area. So where the Pulitzer will be a hub for programming, programs can happen all over the city. Okay, great. And is there a deadline to get those applications in? Yes, the deadline is April 21st. Okay. We will be uh, announcing the grant recipients in mid-May, and then we should have the full program lineup in June. Okay, so all the details of criteria and the process, the application process, are all on your website. Yes. Pulitzer Arts. PulitzerArts.org. Org. Okay, perfect. And we've got a couple weeks till that deadline, so get those applications in. Yes, definitely. <laughs> get those ideas together. Okay, to contribute your proposal for the Marfa Dialogues in St. Louis, visit PulitzerArts.org. And for more information, uh, check out the website there, too. We'll be right back with more STL TV Live. But before we go to break, take a look at today's featured hot job brought to you by Slate and Missouri Workforce Development. Thank you.